All right, hey everybody, this video is for anybody out there that's got a MakerBot Mini and is not wanting to spend the money on buying the build plate tapes that MakerBot offers. Uh, there's a very easy and simple solution for this uh, and it costs you maybe $10. Uh, and it'll last you, I bet, probably a year. <laughs> uh, what you wanna do is head over to like a Walmart or Home Depot or a Lowe's or any sort of store that's nearby you uh, that might sell packing supplies or uh, painting supplies actually. And what you can pick up is this 3M tape. So here I've got the extra wide tape here and then I've got the, uh, the one inch wide tape here. And what you end up doing is, it's very, very simple. Um, what I did was, uh, first actually I'll go through the process of taping out the bottom half and then show you how I taped off the top half here. Um, but I, you take the wide, the wider of the tape, it's about two inches wide or so. Uh, get a good length, rip it off, and then line it up and put it on. So you want to put it flush with the bottom of the build plate. And I'll wrap it around. Don't know how precise this is, but it uh, works pretty well for me. Uh, so then I'm going to take another piece and put it down and we'll try and line it up as best I can so that they're not overlapping, that they're just barely touching. Uh, and what I'm gonna do is not push it down all the way, but what I'm gonna do is you'll find the uh, the little homing pieces here that the MakerBot extruder lines up with. And I'm just taking a, a marker or a pen and identifying those and taking a hole punch here and coming in and punching a hole. There that is. And Oops. I will put this down. And I will put this on. And I'll put it down here. So I might end up redoing this, but you'll notice here there's just a little thin line, which shouldn't be too bad for my uh, uh, burning my prints. Um, and so what you end up doing for this last top piece is. Uh, you take one thin strip here and you can lay it across and do the exact same thing that we just did with the marker here. Uh, but what I did on mine was I just cut off the excess up top. And so now what happens is every, I don't know, half dozen prints that I do, or it all depends on the print that I'm doing actually, uh, I'll just end up replacing these bottom two pieces. I very rarely have to uh, replace the top because I'm very rarely <laughs> printing something that's large enough to fill uh, this entire space of the build plate. So just a little tip there for anybody out there that's got the MakerBot Mini and does not feel like spending, I don't know what it was, like $15 for 10 little pieces of tape pad. Uh, for the same amount of money, you can buy two rolls of tape, probably a hole puncher and <laughs> a marker even that you can use for this. And it, I'm, I'm guessing this will last me the better part of a year with everything that I'm doing. All right. Hey, thanks everybody for watching. Please like, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And I will talk to you soon.